So Zeus has released the Bad Boys Texas Episode 8 trailer, and it looks like they're bullying Banga again. Let's talk about it. The Bad Boys are gonna be recording a song just like they did on last season, and I'm here for it. Banga's here for it too. He says, oh, just write me a verse and I'll tear the shit up. Do my big one. But Prince seems to have a huge problem with that. So let's watch the trailer and we'll discuss. I got a football, I got some flags. So five need on five. And after that, we get the studio. If somebody could write me, like something. Oh, I If we gonna be doing this as a group, let's all put. I know that, we all put, have group, a part, a part to play. You're not, you're not an artist. Y'all not gonna try to include me on on the song. That's what the sh I don't like. Let me call everybody. Yeah. Everybody, bring y'all ass in here. They telling me I got asthma, and I probably could have last night. I'm away from my I, family. I that. At the end of the day, I just want to be around them at this time. You leaving, bro? It's like. Hey, hey, B, come on. I just feel like a kid again, just playing outside with my with my friends. You calling me all of my you name, like and bitch, I like gave yourself. you a compliment. You ain't gave me that compliment. Problem. Yes, I did, bitch. You didn't, you it ain't gonna do nothing. It ain't gonna me, so chill. Watch your tone when you talking to me. Right now is not the time, because I really will hurt you, ho. <laughs> I actually have a hypothesis about that fight. I think Durelli said something to carry on that was kind of flirtatious and carry on took it the wrong way. That's why Durelli was like, I'm trying to give you a compliment. Da -da 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 -da. That's just a hypothesis. I don't know. I don't know. But ooh, the trades well, the trades and the Queens too. They going to be playing football, honey football my um issue is um why are there shirts on and specifically most city in prince why do you guys have shirts on i i have a problem with that i have a problem but it is good to see d relly you know hold some of his weight on this episode because he hasn't really done anything since the first episode when lou ran up on him and he defended himself so it's your turn to do yo big one i feel like zeus tells each person like Okay, you need to get into at least one fight. One fight, okay? Like everyone's contractually obligated. <laughs> Actually, I wouldn't be surprised because most city, he said that they pressure people to fight. That's why he snuck Adonis. Trade needs to fight too. Um, yeah, Prince, you have not held your own and we need to see you scrap. Ooh, who you think will win, Mo City or Prince? I'm not gonna lie, Mo City would deck Prince. Prince, I don't think can fight. Yeah, I don't think Prince can fight like that. He can barely even guard carry on from uh, Dorelli. He looking like he's about to tip over. Uh-uh. And no tea, no shade. I think Bega was right. Lou was scared to fight Adonis. Because I'm sorry, like, I don't have asthma, but people that have asthma, don't you just get an inhaler, you go to the hospital, you get off some sort of medication and you good? It doesn't seem like that big of an issue where you need to go home and you need to be with your family at this time. You sound like you got a goddamn terminally ill condition. Like, boy, that was bullshit. I actually believe Banga in that situation. Big Lou, I'ma call pump fake on that. I think Adonis is probably the best fighter in the house so far. The only person that really stood toe to toe with him was uh, Chef D, and that's because Chef D is huge. Like, Chef D is built like a fucking brick house. Dude's like six foot six. Lord knows how much he weighs. Like, Chef D is huge. Chef D is the type of dude that you wanna have as a bodyguard. He's just intimidating. Let's be real, we talk about Chef D, but would you ever try something with Chef D in person? No. I know I wouldn't. I know Chef D for me. Chef D would fuck me up. <laughs> and Chef D, if he watches my videos, oh my God, he probably would fuck me up. <laughs> He might see me somewhere and try to sneak me. But y'all, this episode looks so juicy. I really want to know what Carry On and Durelli were fighting about, y'all. What do you think they were fighting about? I think it's because Durelli complimented Carry On and it made him uncomfortable. And then Durelli got mad and was like, I'm trying to give you a compliment. Da -da 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 -da. That's what I think. That's what I think. That's what I think. Let me know what you think in the comments.